want more information on how I achieve this look and more about this wig, stay tuned and keep watching. All right, guys. So um, this is me unboxing the um, the hair when I received it. It did come DHL. My shipping was pretty fast. I believe I ordered it on April second, and um, it was delivered on April the eighth. Um, so that's really good to me. Um, the estimated shipping said it would be there um, be to me by April fifteenth. So it was a lot sooner than I expected which I was really happy about so and this is just a box that the um obviously you know the, the package the, the box that the hair came in um really cute packaging and y'all <laughs> I struggled trying to open this box so <laughs> I struggled trying to open it And I have some goodies fall out. I was trying to um, open the package, <laughs> open the box here because it had a cute, um, it was cute inside. And I want to show you guys the inside of it. Um, and as you can see, the hair is from IC Hair. Um, it's, uh, the wig is Princess Series. And this is just um, some instructions on how to care for the hair. Um, these are some lashes that came with it. And those are really, really cute. I'm actually wearing them in the video. And this is um, an elastic band if you want to sew it down on the wig to just give it a little bit more secure. Um, the wig is uh, kinky curly. That's the texture of it. Mongolian and it's a uh, 20 in 20 inches y'all yeah. pulling this hair out the back of the package <laughs> I'm excited um, it was so soft like so soft um, I fell in love with it the inside the lace uh, the cap the clips it comes with four and it has lace on the back as well and adjustable straps just showing you that the lace It is ear to ear. So basically what I'm doing right here is just um, tinting the lace um, instead of bleaching it to bleach the knots. I'm not going to do that. I'm just using another method that I got from YouTube. Um, so yeah, it's just tinting it. In the next clip, you'll see um, me after I put the wig, uh, put the wig on. I'm done putting it on with the um I'm done putting it on putting the clips in so the clips are secured the one in the back is secured uh the two on the side are secured and the one at the top they're all secured um so now this is just the way on I haven't done anything to the lace in the front as far as laying it down yet um so this is just just it on right now. So now we're gonna get into fixing the lace, all that good stuff. Um, I do have, well I did, there we go. So now what we're gonna do is go in and cut it. Cut the lace. Um, I'm 
gonna start with the uh, middle. Cut in the middle. Just because it's a lot easier. I did watch a video where a girl was doing that and um, it just seems like a lot easier than cutting it this way all around. You kind of have like a more, you're kind of like in control more when you can cut this way and then that way. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and really fluffy and obviously this is the area that I have been touching the most um so yeah you're gonna see some pieces also come out like hair come out because I plucked it um I did pluck it so I did some plucking around um this morning so you're gonna see some hair come out but before all of that like this hair didn't shed like when I first washed it when I told y'all I had rinsed it when I first got it I didn't see any shedding and that's crazy for um like a curly a curly wig and y'all when i first unboxed this hair it was so soft it's still soft but it's like when i was unboxing i was like wow this, this hair like when i first pulled it out like this hair is so soft and it's super lightweight and i i just i love it i love it <laughs> yeah i really do i woke up this morning like okay yes i gotta record this video because i'm ready to go and wear this hair even though it ain't nowhere we can go right now um but yeah y'all like this wig is really cute so, and i love it so anyway um i'm just putting mousse only on the the part that was really really frizzy um only on the part that was really really frizzy And the mousse, like y'all can see how the curl pattern is. Oh, and I'm 
I'm using um olive god um olive, <laughs> olive oil foam foam wrap lotion. Um, so I'm just like I said, just putting it on the spots that are a little frizzy. I'm not you know, obviously not putting it on the whole wig. Um, putting it on not putting it all over because I don't need to do that. cool with the way the texture of the curls are in the back. Um, I was just doing its own little natural thing. I'm cool with that. I'm just going to leave it. I'm not even going to wig brush through it. I'm not going to do any of that. <clears throat> I want the natural curl um, to still be there. Olive oil foam, foam wrap lotion. Um, so I'm just, like I said, just putting it on the spots that are a little frizzy. I'm not, you know, obviously not putting it on the whole wig. Um, putting it on, not putting it all over because I don't need to do that. Um, I'm actually cool with the way the texture of the curls are in the back. Um, I was just doing its own little natural thing. brush through it. I'm not going to do any of that. <clears throat> I want the natural curl um, to still be there. Um, so, yeah. Alright, so yeah. I went ahead and finished wetting it up um, with the olive oil foam wrap lotion um again i didn't go in and saturate it because i wanted to keep the the ringlets and the curls how it was already with what was dry and what wasn't frizzy so i just went ahead and, and just did the frizzy parts um i was gonna go in and add baby hairs i don't think i'm going to uh i can really flip this whichever way this is just the way that i decided to to flip it. It's not so much a part. I didn't part it. Uh, I definitely can part a middle part, side part, or this side. Um, the wig allows me to do that, but I don't think I'm going to do a part today. Um, I like the little flip over, how it is right now. So, yeah, I think that's it for, for this. So, y'all like that's it <laughs> y'all watch me do the cut the lace uh, lay it all that um, if you need a tutorial on the ball cap method on how to how to do it I can do that um, if you'd like just you know make a comment and I'll uh, whenever I take this down and wash my hair I'll record that and then I'll upload it for y'all but I just felt like that would make the video even longer because that process is, um, it's, it's not a process, but it, you know, can get a little hectic. And for me, I was just like, so glad I didn't report that part. But yeah, y'all, so this is the, um, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this video. This is the, the Kiki Curly, um, Mongolian, um, wig from Icy Hair. It's the Princess Series. Um, it's Icy, I think it's Icy Beauty. I see beauty on Instagram, um, and this is a 20 inch wig, which is, you know, for curly hair is 20 inches stretched, which it is coming down almost to my, my waist, but um, I'm short, so, but yeah, so definitely check them out. I will leave everything in the, in the description below, um, how my shipping was and all that, um, which wasn't long at all, uh, so yeah, y'all just definitely check them out and I know they have a lot of other um they have a lot of other wigs that I I want to try out and again I don't know if I even told y'all this in the beginning but this wig was only 159 I think I think it was like it was 150 something I'll put that in the description too once I get the exact um, details of how much it was but this wig was like 159 157 something like that and for that for 
this for that amount is crazy because this wig is beautiful. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up. Um, thanks so much for watching. Definitely like if you liked it. Thumbs it up, thumbs it down if you didn't. Comment either way. Thank you for um, coming out to watch my video. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed, and I'll see you on the next one.